Hello everyone, this is Daryl20 and welcome to episode 22 of Daryl20's Stone Block series. What's up everybody, how's it going? We killed an Ender Dragon. That's what's up. Nice. Uh, so that is cool. That's what we did last episode. So I'm just handing in some quests. We also got our hands on the Philosopher's Stone, which we can claim a quest reward for that as well. Any good loots? Eh, just another Envar Hammer. Gotten quite a few of those. Hey, Resonant Conversion Kits. That's what's up. That is what's up. Resonant Conversion Kits. That is awesome. We've got a couple Resonant Upgrade Kits, but Conversion Kits are even cooler. Uh, so... Today, I'd like to, if we can, play a little bit with Project E. So there's a few paths that we can take from here. Uh, Tome of Knowledge. Uh, learn everything that has an EMC value. Is that craftable? Because usually, oh, 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 Endist Pearl. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> That's hilarious. Endist Pearl. Uh, I don't know that I want, well, I mean, I kind of wouldn't mind it. I don't know. Do we want? Yeah. I mean, we have there's we we have a long way to go before we get to that. Clearly, clearly, we have a long way to go. Um, but there's other things we can get. Also, as we know, the transmutation tablet um, is a very, very expensive recipe, um, and the transmutation table is also a very, very expensive recipe, uh, which is part of the reason that we're getting these neutronium nuggets, uh, but we need some dark matter, we need some HDPE sheets, we need some night slime, um, which sadly does not have an EMC value, so we're going to have to figure out how to get night slime. Oh, there's night slime essence, though, so if I got a few night slime, uh, I could totally get some night slime essence. There's night slime chickens, too. Uh, which just need manulin and pig iron. Uh, so that's an option as well if we want to get night slime. Uh, so yeah, wow. Infinity ingots, huh? If I, get, if I want to get the one that you can carry around. So the transmutation tablet, for those of you who may or may not remember, um, you, you carry this around in your inventory. Uh, whereas the transmutation table is a block in the world that you can interact with. So, you know, the tablet's nice, right? Uh, but, but the, you know, the table is just, just good enough. It's just plenty. So we need pixie dust. So we need to get into Batania. We might need to get into Tinkers or we get chickens to do it for us. But Tinkers is probably going to be faster, um, uh, because Night Slime, it's an alloy of molten iron, liquid purple slime and seared stone. This comes from purple slime blocks, which, uh, we can probably get from chickens or loot bags or bonsai trees. Ooh. Yeah, purple slime saplings. I wouldn't mind that. Which we can get from rare loot bags. So uh, we can totally get that from, from saplings. That is cool. All right. So that's one option, right? Okay. Um, but then the other things we can get... Uh, so we're going to hold off on the transmutation tablet. Because we, we need a lot to get to that point. Um, but first, we can definitely work on uh, dark matter if we want. And we can get some dark matter stuff. Uh, and we can also look at making an alchemical chest, and we can eventually work at the energy condensers, because those are where I'm going to want to be. So let's first start with an alchemical chest, right? That shouldn't be too bad. Um, what I'm thinking is uh, evil infused ingots. Oh, 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 I know this one. Uh, oh, it's, uh, okay, that doesn't look so bad. So we need an enchanter. That looks totally doable. Uh, enchanter. Uh, so we need a machine block, and we also need any enchanted book. Do we have the enchanter from Ender.io yet? We should look at that. You know what else we should look at? Well, no, I have a Tome of Experience, so we're actually pretty cool. I have so much experience, I don't even know what to do with it. So we're good, actually, with regards to that. I'll hang on to this because it looks like we need this for a minute. But uh, can we get the enchanter from you uh so i just need a book which is totally craftable now and dark steel uh which is uh an alloying recipe we can induction smelter steel and obsidian though do we have easy access to steel eh, yeah. might as well do it the proper way which is uh ender io so it's uh obsidian pulverized coal and iron Right, uh, so that'll be cool. So let's pop over here. This might take a really long time because I have yet to be not lazy. Hmm? 
Is dark steel not a thing that I can do in the simple hour? Okay, it might be time for me to be less lazy. Might be time. It might be time to be a little bit less lazy. Now I can, can I upgrade you? So if I had two of you, I could upgrade you to the alloy smelter. But I need dark steel to get you. Right? Alloy smelter, yes. If I want an alloy smelter, we need a dark bimetal gear. Interesting. So if I need dark steel to get you, Oh, that's part of why it's charcoal. There's part of your problem. Don't mind me. Just start derping a little bit. Just a little bit. Don't tell anyone. There's your problem. Okay. Hey, it looked like it. Cut me some slack. All right, that'll take probably a really long time because dark steel is usually really slow by itself. So let's come back in a minute. Um, or we can just let this cook and work on a few other things for a few minutes. So I need the enchanter. Um, so I just need some kind of enchanted book. Any kind of enchanted book, I presume. Yeah, we can just make whatever with you. Um, let's get a book and quill ready here. Do I have feathers? Do I not have feathers? I, mean, I guess that makes sense that I wouldn't have feathers. Um, so what we can do to get feathers. There's a block, the hen house. No, I don't think it's the hen house. There's a block from chickens, or maybe it's roost. There's one. Could have sworn that you can put chickens in. Nesting pen? Is that what it's called? What mod is that from? Hatchery. Ah. 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 Ha ha. -ha. This will get me feathers, I'm pretty sure. Can I? I don't think I can put these in there, though. But what I can do... Are you? No. Let's do this. Uh, hang on. Let's get uh, a fast chicken if I have one. Gold, 10, 10, 10, that should be fine. Uh, and then we need an animal net to capture it. So I can do that, I can do that, I can do that. There we go. Next drop, now can I? I can do that, sweet. So this should, um... Cool, look at you go. Maybe get me feathers. Yup. Booyah. Called it. Nice. That I can then use to get a book and quill. Hooray. How are you doing, buddy? Still cooking, apparently. We've got two, though, so that's nice. I got that going for me. All right, the last little bit. So then we can get an enchanted book so we can make the enchanter so that we can make the evil nuggets so we can get uh, what we need to get for an alchemical chest. And then I'd like to get a condenser because condensers are gonna allow me to use EMC before we get uh, the table, right? And I'll show you what I'm talking about if you're not super sure. Because it's been a long time since I've done Project E or Equivalent Exchange, which it used to be back, back in the day. Project E was basically a fork of equivalent exchange. Uh, so that's cool. So enchanter will allow me to get any enchanted book that I want, which is good times. Cool. Uh, and we're going to need lapis. And we're going to need pretty much anything. There we go. That'll work for me. 
it doesn't matter which uh, book we get. So we're cool. So the Enchanter from Extra Utilities 2 is now mine. Uh, now I don't know if I need power for him. I feel like I do though. Uh, I feel like I probably do. Uh, torches. Torches. I, you know what I'm gonna do? That'll work for me. All right, so we can then get some leadstone, throw down this bad boy, and we're cool. Now, I'm not entirely sure if you need... Chandra requires a full set of nearby bookshelves or other enchantment boosting blocks. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, my favorite enchantment boosting box are mana pylons, because they are also enchantment boosting. Um, and two of those is like full blown, right? But I don't know if we have mana diamonds. We have mana steel, and we have mana in a bottle. Um, do we have any black lotus? We do have some black lotus. All right. So should we, like, real quick set up a thing? Um, so here's the deal. Uh, we're going to want floral fertilizer, right? And for that, we're going to need bone meal. Which, again, we have such a silly amount of bones, I am not worried about grinding bones, right? So get me a bunch of floral fertilizer. A stack should do it. Hooray, quest complete. Uh, let's get uh, some... Some stuff around here. good to me uh, and then we can have more bone meal I'm just gonna put all this stuff away for now I'm not gonna worry too much about it so I'll take my bone meal and I should have shears already some somewhere but I guess not so we'll make some and then we will get our white mystical flowers Cool. And that's that. You guys have seen me do Batania enough, right? Uh, that you know what I'm doing. Um, and then uh, the, whatchamacallit thing, the Petal Apothecary is what I need. And then a bucket of water. Seeds. And we've got our pure base. Beautiful. And then we're going to want some stone around that dude. And we'll let that cook for a minute. And you know what I can do? Super OP. Pretty sure this works. Yeah, it does. Alright, not that OP, but still cool. And we can get that. We can get our lotus. Oh, you need a little bit of mana in there, don't you? In order to convert, you need some mana. All right, so that means that we are going to need to get uh, the endo flame, uh, which is brown, brown, red, and light gray. So a red, brown, and light gray. All right, uh, water, please. Bucket, please. Whew. 
this may not have been faster than making all the bookshelves, but it'll look better in the end. Alright, so endo was what again? Uh, two browns and a red. And a light gray. Cool. Uh, and then we're going to want some wood. That we can speed up. And then we can vein mine. Wrong tool, I know, but it's still fast enough. Uh, and then we can get a spreader. Right. And then we can drop you, and we can drop, I don't know, a block of coal. Does that sound fair? Now, can I tick, tick accelerate you? Uh, you know what I probably should make is a wand of the forest. I mean, I should make it, but it doesn't look like we actually need it, so that's cool. And I happen to have a couple extra of these dudes, so that's cool. Can I do that? I oh, that is... <laughs> Sorry, Basky. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I apologize. I 100% apologize, Basky. That is... Super rude. But that might be enough to do that. All right, so that's enough to get me going, right? So now we can get uh, our mana pylons. One, two of these should be sufficient to make this enchanter work. Um, what if we put them here and here? Is that... Is that cool, or do you need to be on this like the same? Are you not happy with that? Do you need like line of sight or something here? Like what's the deal? They might need line of sight. Yeah, it does need line of sight. Mwah, mwah. So what I can do is something like this. Does that work for line of sight? No, nah, I guess it has to be closer than that. Nope. I wonder Is this just a case of dire not knowing vanilla rules? Come on. Killing me smalls. Oh yeah, no, that's cool. That works. So you just need like power. Uh which we can totally Use a wireless. Uh, this dude for right. Oh, that should help, right? I like I like that. That that's cool. Now, if I put you there, does that? That does. Totally breaks it. But that's all right. Good enough for me. So that's cool. So now we need um, iron. So let's get like 32 of them and some stars and you're enchanting. Do we have any speed upgrades for my buddy? How broken would that be in terms of GPUs? Oh, GP ain't bad with that. It's really RF that becomes a problem at that speed, but that's okay. Oh wow, we get a decent amount of evil infused ingots from that craft. I thought it was one 
for another star, and it is four or eight. That's awesome. All right, so you just need more power. Uh, so we could just say, give me a flux point for removing energy from the flux network. That shouldn't be too bad to craft up. And now we have plenty of power, so you can go away, and that works just fine. Sweet. All right, so back in a minute when we're ready for alchemical chest time. All right, so with that taken care of, I think we're pretty close. Uh, I just need a chest, which I just taught uh, the system how to make. What do you mean, uh, refined iron? I need refined iron for the iron chest? Does it have to be refined iron? Oh, it can be either refined iron or regular iron. Well, there's, there's your problem. Uh, where's my iron chest? Let's fix this recipe. Do the thing properly. There you go. That's better. Now, where was I? Oh, right. Diamond chest. So I should be able to auto-craft one of them, no problem. Bing, bang, boom. Uh, and then we just need uh, that those dusts. So, oh, we need an empower for the dusts? Oh, today I learned. Okay, cool. Not the end of the world, um, but we need an empower from actually additions. So, actually additions, empower time. Let's do the thing. That shouldn't be too big of a problem though should be easy to make uh, um just where i'm gonna put it we could probably put it over here ish i could squeeze it in this general area right next to my to these things right i might need to move those a little bit but i'm sure we can make it work uh so the empower uh so first we need uh we totally need an atomic doohickey so I think we've got, I, I, yeah, I got those, cool. Was not prepared to make an empowerer today. But we can make this happen. So we want a button. Right, uh, and we are going to basically I think I'll put you right here, Mr. Empower, with a button like that. Uh, we want a redstone torch so that you're in pulse mode and then the pulse works. Uh, and then we're going to want some power. So we could just do our flux point again. It seems silly to do that, but the line of sight issues over there kind of are what's up. Maybe I'll clear out underground a little bit. Um, so here's a neat idea. I want to try this out. This is not something that I originally designed this mod to be able to do. But if I did a one depth and let's do two, 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 two. Ah, blah, blah, blah. Right, and we did, well, I don't want to catch you. Right, so we're definitely gonna have you here. So the empower, if the empower were to sit here, right, it would be one, two, it's two spaces per, so technically the empower should sit here, right? And then here, 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 and here. So I can set you to Daryl 20s network. Right, and then if I told you undo, it doesn't overwrite blocks. Cool. Uh, so that's nifty. That's a neat way to approach it, right? Might not be too bad. Um, maybe I'll bring you down a level. Yeah, I think I should do that. Just so we can have a flat floorboard, right? Yeah. 
Yeah, because you can totally branch off like that. And that's pretty neat. I like that. Okay, cool. So that'll be our thing, right? Um, and then we can cover up most of this flooring. And that will just have to be what it is. Uh, so you should have power now. Uh, let's get some redstone and let's get uh, some... Well, we'll just start off with redstone. Hooray! Cool. Uh, so for the empower, uh, we're also going to want... Actually, we have gold nuggets, right? Yes. All right, cool. So empower will be... Um, so we need... Let's put all you guys in here. I need five of these, right? So that I can get five of these. Now you are a block of quartz. So we need 15 of those, right? So I forget the numbers here, but let's just, because we don't care. Right, I think I can do that. I think that's accurate. Yeah, that should work. Cool. And then you're used, we're going to need these guys all to be this. And then you're used like that. And then you just need um, just get a bunch of that, because why not? Some of this, some iron, just load it up, because who cares? We have tons of these resources. These are things that we've already automated like crazy, right? Um, that's what we need. And then we can upgrade you. We just need two of those. And we've got our empower. Nice. It kind of fits a little bit. Not perfect, but it functions, right? So for the alchemical chest, right, we're going to need covalence dust. Uh, so for the green one, we need three redstone around double compressed cobble, right? Um, And you can be depth of zero again, so I don't accidentally click you somewhere. All right, cool, beans. Nice, put you away, and we've got, now how much of that did we get? 40, perfect, that's what I was hoping for, right? And then base essence ingot is that, which was a quest, by the way. And then four redstone around you. And I didn't look at what the last one needs, but hopefully it's not too crazy. Ah, uh, an infused diamond. Okay. Didn't we look at this at one point and realize that there's a recipe for you? Yeah, there is. Sweet. Do the thing. Oh, it's coal. <laughs> of course it is, because... Why would we be consistent? You might notice I have a lot of coal. There's a reason for that. Hooray! So we've got these things now. Cool. Uh, which means we can now make an alchemical chest. Boom! And that is a quest. Nice. Anything good? Uh, charm, mining AOE, cool. Not interested. But we got the alchemical chest, which is super cool because now, uh, if we want, we can draconic infuse that into an energy condenser. So we're going to need some fusion crafting. Oh, it's draconic, dear? Wow. Okay. That's not too bad, though. That's not too bad, right? 
Um, we can get this stuff, the dirt chest and the crystal chest. Because if we can get an energy condenser, that would be super awesome. I promise that would be super cool to have, right? So we're going to totally need to get into fusion crafting, which shouldn't be too bad. Uh, but we do need draconic tier infusion. Uh, what is it called? These guys, Draconic Fusion Crafters. So we need some Awakened Draconian Blocks, um, which is 350 million RF. Wow, that is craziness. Um, we might not be as close to this as I had hoped. I was hoping we could get this, but that looks a little bit crazy. 350 million RF? There are, though, to be fair, aren't there Draconic Chickens? There are. And Awakened Draconium Essence which we can totally take a look at getting. So yeah, that's not too easy to get our hands on, um, but it's not bad. So the Awakened Draconium Chicken um, is Draconium and Ender Pearl. That's, that's probably a pretty deep breeding tree, um, but it's doable, it's doable, right? Does Awakened Draconium, it does not have EMC. But we're making progress for sure. Now I do have other ideas and how we can get that large amount of power that we're gonna need. I have ideas, guys. They're a little bit crazy, these ideas, but I have them. Unfortunately though, we have reached the wrapping up point for the episode, so let's do this. We'll come back next time uh, and we'll work towards some crazy amounts of power and getting into Draconic Evolution uh, and getting into all kinds of other cool things. But for now, uh, Donald 20 signing off. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Take it easy.